Hey hey! Today I'll be doing my empties and I'm going to be showing you all of these products that I've been used up the last kind of six months. I've just been saving all the products I've finished and I'm going to be letting you know kind of a mini review of them, just like would I buy them again or not, did I like them or not. Yeah, it's a mixture of hair products, body products, skincare, makeup and everything so I'm just gonna get into it because it's a lot of products so let's start with stuff for the body because that's what I got most of and to begin with I just finished off one of my favorite buff products at all times like serious it is MOA so sort of modern organic apothecary uh, green buff potion and this stuff is amazing like it's so like I need to just order one right away. It smells so good. It's like with peppermint and fennel, and you just put like a couple of capfuls in the bath, and it's just you can just feel like your body just gets so soothed, and you're working it like your muscles feels looser, and it's just like especially if like you worked yourself really hard or it's really tired. You just feel like a new person coming out of that bath and it's just so amazing. Like any other bath product after this is just gonna disappoint you to be honest. It's so good, like seriously, seriously good. So I would definitely buy this again. And then another bath product which is from Neil's Yard and it's aromatic foaming bath. So it's great for like if you one of those people who like a bit more foam in your bath, like big bubbles. But as I said, my other, my my eyes is so much better. They're like, I like this, but I'm just like, if I have both of them and I'm gonna choose, I'm always gonna go for the mo one. Sometimes I add a little bit of this in with this, just have a bit of bubbles as well. So that's quite a nice idea, and I would purchase this again actually. And then a recent discovery for me. Um, from last year is actually starting to use body oils and um, body oils are just so amazing so I have a couple of body oils and one of them are from botanicals and we all know that I love botanicals and it's spa detox aromatic body oil and it's funny because I got a little sample from them and it smelled so much licorice I had to order the big one and it didn't smell as much as licorice but it's still lovely again it's fennel so I clearly like fennel products um, it feels really lovely on your body and it just feels like it's best like as soon as you get out of the shower or bath and just kind of still that slightly damp it just gets really nice into your body I would definitely buy it again and then Queen of the Elves it's Max and Me oils and I had it I lost the lid on it if you wonder um but yeah it's like i won this uh on rainbow feet blog or uh, instagram and oh, i got so excited because these are expensive and but they are so pretty like i've always wanted one of these and they're so 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 pretty it's amazing it smells really lovely it feels really good and i just really really enjoy this and i just love having it like standing on the shelf and just looks so pretty in the bathroom so I would definitely buy this again if I feel like I have the money to spend like I think it's a perfect like really nice present for someone I just don't know it's not a product like I would go and buy regularly because I just feel like I can't really justify that money are so gorgeous and I would love to try more of their oils as well like facial oils and everything but it's just, yeah they are so lovely but they're expensive so I've been using some amazing creams as well and one of those are Neil's Yard Remedies Beauty Sleep Body Butter and this is amazing like it's so lovely it's hard to get talking about getting hard to get into your skin this is hard to get into your skin like you really have to work it but once it's in there it stays there and it feels so hydrated so smooth and just lovely so i love doing this like in it's like beauty it's kind of more like if i have an evening bath and it's relaxed really want to relax myself 
and then I'll put this on after. It's just like a proper treat. It's just so nice and it smells lovely. Really no enjoy this. Uh, I would buy this again but I don't really use it that often because I don't, I'm mainly like a morning shower person so this is more for like evening kind of use so I don't really see so it took me a long time to get through so I had this for a very long time uh, so I'm not 100% sure like if I'm actually gonna buy it again but it's an amazing product so next up is another amazing body butter it's from Lion Sleeve and it's just my skin saviour in the winter like every winter I just have to have this stuff like I don't really use it much in the summer but as soon as winter comes and my body just got then dry or I feel like it's just I have to have this stuff um, so I just finished this today and I'm already bought a new one because I'm like I need this in my life uh, in Swedish winters it's just ruthless to your skin so this is my biggest protection I can get and it's just like awesome so I'll definitely buy this again and if you haven't tried this you should really 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 try them they are amazing then I got some deodorants so first one is Valera the citrus deodorant it's like a little spray thing and I mainly had this for my travels and it's been alright not amazed by it uh, probably won't buy it again but it's okay I mean. and then to another deodorant which has been amazing and that is Caravier it's a Swedish brand uh, neutral deodorant and it's a unisex so for both men and women so both me and Stephen has been using this and it's really really good it's like a good proper protection and it's quite a neutral smell like so it doesn't really smell much but it just really keeps you fresh definitely one of the best organic and natural deodorants I ever tried so if you have a chance to pick this up Caravillard an amazing amazing deodorant so next up is aloe vera from Sukin and yes aloe vera is a very very important product I have one in my home I have one at work I always take it with me in my travel because you don't know when you need aloe vera seriously like whether it's you're out in the sun and burning yourself, uh, you pour hot tea on yourself, uh, you're ending up burning yourself and taking something out of the oven, or I use it off. All these things have happened to me, just by the way, if you wonder. Yeah, aloe vera, you need it in your life, just deal with it. So I finished it, I got already a new one because I haven't ordered two things once because I've ordered a different one, but yeah, I would, don't go anywhere without aloe vera. And then let's move to the top of your head, which is your hair. So my hair products. So first of all is Sink and Say Shampoo and Conditioner, but I'm going to use this shampoo, uh, from John Masters Organic. And this is some amazing stuff. I'll probably use up two of these, but I only saved one because I thought, why well, should I sit on hold two? Uh, and it's the number seller thing with this shampoo. If I ever want anyone to buy this, I let them smell it because it smells amazing. Like it smells like toffee. It smells so good. Like seriously. But yeah, it's an amazing shampoo. It's really good for dry hair or dry scalp. It's very good for like. It's also good for guys because it's very like shampoo and conditioner in it for them. That's normally enough. For my hair, it's not enough, so I use conditioner as well after, and I just loving, loving, loving this. At the moment, I definitely will buy more. I already have one more in my bathroom, but um, I also at the moment using a different one because my scalp is very dry because of the winter as always. So I felt like I needed to step up my game a little bit, and um, but I'm definitely using this again. And then conditioner, and this is my favourite hair product of all times. So you've probably heard me talk about it a million times already, but it is John Masters Organics, again, uh, Lavender and Avocado Intensive Conditioner. So this is like, you can use it as a normal conditioner, but also use it as like a more extreme treatment. So I leave it on for a little bit and just I really let it soak in. And a lot of people just use it as treatments as well because it's a little bit more pricey, but it's like, my staple product in my bathroom like I do always have this 
and it is sadly finished and I will very likely pick up a new one at work tomorrow because that's how lucky I am because I got all my products right next to me every day. So next up is conditioner from Neil's Yard Remedies and I don't hardly even remember me buying this but I did and I think it was fine, I don't really remember that either. So it's not a product I really put themselves like wow I'm amazing kind of thing in my head so I probably very likely won't buy this again um but it's a good product but I just yeah don't think I will because I just don't really remember to be honest and it was quite a few months since I finished this so to be honest but um otherwise they do amazing products nails yard but I'm like no I won't buy it yeah then I just have like a little travel sizes from Yeah Rock so shampoo and conditioner Vidurak is a really cool little brand that I recently discovered and I got this in a goodie bag and I brought it with me to my travels and I'll finish them but it's been like I, I really like your rock as like a brand they're really cool they're all 100% vegan like every single one of their products which is really cool all natural and everything got but so this is like a volumizing shampoo and volumizing products doesn't really go hand in hand with my somehow my scalp doesn't like it as much but then I have like other products from them that I really really enjoy so I probably would buy something from them but I just wouldn't buy the volumizing shampoo and conditioner so let's move on to our face and do skincare so next up is my dear orchid Bears eye cream and I really enjoy this it's been really good it lasted a long time because you only need like the tiniest, tiniest amount and just put it all around your little eyes and I've been using it every morning and it's been really good, I enjoyed it so yes, I would buy it again and then I have a hydrating day cream from Sukin with Rosehip and this one took a long time to get through because it's massive for a little cream and it's like 120ml and it's so much cream in there and you didn't need a lot and I just really like the, I love rose hip uh, and it just thinks really good for your skin so, and I just, yeah, I really liked it and Sukin as well is such an affordable brand and it's like £25 I think for like this massive jar that was amazing and yeah, I would, I would definitely buy this again so then I have some night creams and the first one is from Neil's Yard, the Nourishing Orange Flower and this one is really amazing. I just really love how it feels on my skin. But I really, really like this and I would definitely buy this again. I just got some makeup left. And so next up is my Orchid Base Foundation. And this is in the shade Cold. This is like perfect for my skin tone. It's really, really good. And it fits like it's perfect with me. And I just really enjoy it and I also love like the packaging which is like pump going up and exactly the same as the eye cream uh, and you just see for you can see exactly where you are and also with this pump that going up it just really helps to get every single bit of your foundation out of here so it's like you get to use all of it which is amazing I would definitely buy this again because it's, I just think it's a really good product and it's just amazing fit for my skin tone and then it's mascara. It always feels like it's always mascara because mascara just doesn't last very long. Uh, so this is the Living Nature uh, in jet black. And I love Living Nature's mascaras. They are so good. I ordered, already got a new one that is also soon going to run out. I ordered a different colour, like a black brown, just by mistake. But I do really enjoy it that too. Uh, so yeah, a really amazing mascara. I can see if can see the brush it's about. It's very good, and it just really helps to get the volume up and a really nice colour and blend it well and everything. So yes, very happy with that, and always, always gonna keep ordering from Living Nature because they are amazing. And that was all my empty products. It's crazy. I will also list everything below, so I have it on there. If it, anything that you would like to look into, like purchase or anything. I will list all and I'll try to get links to everything as well. Yeah. That was the end of my empties products. Thank you so much for watching. It means a lot to just say you watch me and support me. 
and um, please give this a thumbs up if you like it and don't forget to subscribe as you can do down here and also up here you can just watch some of my other videos and I hope you'll enjoy them. See you soon. Bye.